thousands of people will be making their way to Springfield over the next week for a few weeks for the Illinois State Fair, and today people were making the finishing touches. Food vendors spent the day setting up in preparation for opening day tomorrow. WCI3's Theodora Coulevars is live in our Capitol Newsroom. Theodora, many of them have been here before. That's right, Brandon. Many of them have served fairgoers for decades, and they're looking forward to welcoming both new and returning customers when the State Fair opens tomorrow morning. The State Fair is packed with all kinds of events and activities, from rides to harness racing and to concerts. But you can't go a few steps without finding a bite to eat or something to drink. I think Illinois is wonderfully reflected through our agricultural partners in the Illinois Department of Agriculture tent. You can get something deep fried everywhere on almost any corner, which is kind of a staple of the State Fair. Food vendors spent Wednesday preparing for opening day. I'm really just looking forward to, you know, seeing some return customers. I love seeing the people come back each year. Some food vendors are from Illinois, but others like the Donut family make the trip from out of state, setting up shop on the fairgrounds. We come back for the people. Everyone loves our donuts. Uh, we love Illinois. It's kind of been our one of our favorite events. And they, like other vendors, have been serving fairgoers for years. I've seen a lot of people, you know, 4-H kids grow up and, you know, and then their kids. So it's kind of cool. Vost Corn Dogs has been a staple at the State Fair for nearly 60 years, serving their signature corn dogs. I think what brings people back is that sense of nostalgia. Every year, like that's their tradition, and we want to we want that to continue for them. It all started with Bob Vost, who was known as the Corn Dog King. He died last year, but his family is committed to carrying on his legacy. My grandpa started something and and it's not just corn dogs it's just a tradition you know people uh, it, there's a camaraderie they come here they all have stories about their first corn dog or they take pictures and and so yeah it means a lot to me i i definitely take pride in in everything we do while some of your favorites might be back at the fair this year, there's also some new places to try. They have more than a dozen new food vendors this year, including Scoop Du Jour, which is based in Chatham. Reporting live in Springfield, I'm Theodora Coulevaris, WCIA 3, your local news leader.